Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do something very exciting. I'm going to play the preview of the SFS career mode. All you have to do to get to this career mode is make a new world and name it test career. Then you're going to create that new world and you will get this message. It says career mode is currently a very minimal prototype with only a few missions and unlocks. If this prototype gets any positive feedback, we will add tons of missions, unlocks and polish it to perfection. Space Flight Simulator development team. Now when you go play this world, this career mode, you will see this building which you also see in the normal version now. But you can also go to research and development and the achievements. But this time when you do any of the achievements, it will give you money to go to research and development and buy new parts. Now when you buy these parts, you will be able to build bigger and better rockets and be able to go further and complete more of the achievements. And that once again will give you more money and that's how it is a loop. Now as you can see they haven't uh, added a lot yet, which they probably will since a lot of people are liking it already, this career mode, because we will be able to do a lot more stuff in this game. We will be obviously just able to do the playthrough of the career mode but we will also be able to do speed runs and challenges and all kinds of stuff so as you can see you start off with very minimal parts including a solid rocket booster which is the thing on the right and then above that is another solid rocket booster but a bit bigger and then you get to all kinds of parts and uh, in the gray one at the second level it's kind of hard to explain because I can't really zoom in farther than I am now. You will see the first liquid fuel engine, which is a different engine than any engines in the game so far, or at least in the starter version. So it's quite cool to be able to play with that. So you can just play like, nor like normal, but you just have way less parts to begin with. So for example, you could build this. You can also just make stages immediately, but you can go like this and then you can just launch a rocket. It's obviously a solid rocket booster, so you can only uh, turn it on once and then you won't be able to turn it off and on anymore. So it just goes, like in real life as well. Then you can obviously just detach this thing, the capsule, and it will fall back down and you can deploy the parachute. As I said, like normal, but you can't go high in the beginning. So you have to get all of those parts and unlock those parts to uh, go higher and further. You can also go to the moon which gives you a lot of money and so you just continue. And well I've now deployed my parachute, I'm going to land, am I already full tire orbiting? Yes I am. And then when you land you can click recover like normal once again. But now when you click recover you will see that it gives you a mission achievements thing which says the achievements that you have achieved. And for example, I have now reached 1000 meters in altitude, which gives me 10 million dollars. So I recover and then I go exit to space center and I can go to research and development and I can now buy this second part. And this way you can continue and so you will be able to do a lot of stuff. Not yet, but you will when the full update is released. Now, as soon as the full version of this career mode is released, I will do a full playthrough of it. And I will probably have to do that in multiple parts, because it will be a very big career mode, I think. Not sure, but I think it will be. But for now, this is what I'm going to leave it at. Because then there's much more to discover when the full update comes out. And so I hope you guys liked this video and a bit of the information that I was able to give you. And if you did enjoy this video, then please give it a like. And subscribe to my channel for the full playthrough but also for other SFS videos and then I hope to see you in the next video so thanks for watching and bye bye